just missed my turn. It's okay. Hi, everybody. It's me. It's Free. I am excited about today. It's Rita. It's your Uber driver. Hi. I had just finished eating dinner. I am full. And not full. You know what? Anyway. Hi. It's me. It's Rita. And welcome back. Thank you for joining me today. Don't forget to uh, follow me on Facebook, Snapchat, Instagram, Twitter, and Periscope. It's all Uber H Town. U B E R H T O W N. Uber H Town. And you'll see my pretty face just smiling. There you go. All right. Here's the thing. I am, hmm, I'm a woman of a, of a particular age. You know what that means, especially if you if you watch Wendy. There you go. Anyway, um, I stay in the Houston area, not necessarily Houston. I'm also an Uber driver. I'm also a Lyft driver, whatever. Anyway, um, one of the things that I find interesting and really quite fascinating about these small towns that's around the Houston area is their diversity. They, okay, how should I put this? What I love about this place, uh, uh, especially around Houston, is their love for the fellow man. They really do. They really do care about one another out here. Um, also, there are more interracial relationships that are going on around here because I see all these little half black, half white, Latino looking babies that are running all over the place. Literally. The other thing that I like about this this area, um, especially Seabrook, um, Webster, League City, uh, Kima. What I love about those areas is that there's some sugar mamas out here. I'm not one. I am not a sugar mama. But these women are on it. They're divorced, widowed, whatever, and they are snatching up these young boys like they are just the freshest thing off, off the bakery shelf. I kid you not. I've never seen anything like this. They are, they're on it. They are on it. These women are empowered. They know exactly what they want. They know how to go out there and get it. They have their own homes, their own cars, their own bank accounts, and they work a phenomenal job. They work hard for what they do. If they're divorced, widowed, separated, whatever, these guys are out there trying to find themselves a sugar mama and I kid you not they are coming in droves I've never seen anything like this before um, case in point uh, I had a friend that um, he was so into his older woman he's 28 going on 29 years old now mind you he doesn't have any children or anything like that and she has a son his age Mm -hmm. so when he finally found the love of his life or so he thought that he found the love of his life she just dissed him and he's running after her like a little puppy dog mommy mommy please 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 not to make light of that because I know how it is not to be you know the person that's so in love Versus the one that could care less if you live or die. Anyway, um, it, it's it's going on. I mean, literally going on. I went to a club with a friend of mine the other um, two weeks two weekends ago, and we were uh, we were amazed at how many younger men are out there hunting down these cougars they're hunting them down I, you've never seen anything like this the summertime is it's crazy 
it's crazy. I've had women in my in my car before that were telling me about their little uh, their little cubs and how you know these these men <clears throat> these men excuse me and how these men are actually going after them and coming after them hard. I said what? So it's no longer this May December relationship that's, that's one sided, which is the men that are that have the younger women it's not cougar time it is cougar time big time in this part of texas you'd be surprised these women look phenomenal they go out there they get the hair the nails everything done they go out there get the liposuction they make themselves look beautiful beautiful and these guys are tracking them down i've never seen anything like that well, if you are a cougar that is looking for a mate, come on out here to Texas. If you are a um, a cub looking for your for your cougar, come on out here to Texas. And uh, if you're those weird people that like mistresses and want me to pierce your your tongue and your navels and and do all those other little crazy things that you've been telling me to do on the dating site go away no thank you but i will take a cup but you gotta be cute i don't just want any other cup no but i will take a cup as a matter of fact i had a cup i actually had two hey i'm a dangerous woman Anyway, if you like what you hear and you want more, <laughs> give me a big thumbs up. Also, subscribe. Hit the little subscribe button. Subscribe. Subscribe. Hit the notification button as well so that you can see, hear, see, and know when I do another video. I know I'm hyped up right now. I know I'm not supposed to be doing Red Bull, but I had to have one. I was sleepy. Anyway, follow me on Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat, Facebook, and Periscope. All over H-Town. In the meantime, in between time, you guys have yourself a fantastic day. Peace.